Hey everyone, welcome back to some pop culture nonsense. In this case, it's video games. And we have this big non-troversy going around where um, there's a claim that people are all upset about uh, this new, uh, that, I, I forget the character, because uh, this is not, you know, Tifa has had her cups reduced, her boobs reduced. Um, who has been accused of having beast up. This is one of these things where you, 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 you see what they're talking about and you're like, no one's talking about this. I don't see scores of it. I, the, the channels I subscribe to, if anyone was this bent out of shape about uh, the reduction in her boob size, I would get suggestions every day. Unless, of course, YouTube is just burying them with their crazy algorithm. Um, so here we have a uh, from a, a GameSpot.com. Uh, we'll say a non controversy article by, it uh, looks like Kaylee Plage, uh, Plage, as that's her name. We need to talk about how uh, bra sizes work. Uh I know how they work. Um, the cup size is the difference between uh, cross over the nipples and the underneath the, the, the breast uh, band size. Um, as a number of women's magazines say, 80% of women are wearing the yep, because they don't measure themselves. Uh, because bar shopping is hell on earth, basically impossible unless you in, invite a total stranger into the fitting room to help measure your pro properly. Because, yes, you need to be uh, topless, really, to get it done right. Um, J.C. Penney uh, used to, in their catalog for years, this is how come I know, because I read the page when I was, you know, an ad pre-adolescent goofball. Um, and also be a result of our society's complete misunderstanding what bra sizes are, even even are. It would help if I wrote, I read the things the way they're in. If the video game industry disclosed any indication, most people seem to think the bra size is stop at double D, that anything smaller than huge, but it's in the AB range. That's, that's like about a handful. Um, that's smaller. And then triple A is even smaller. I'm talking, of course, about Tifa Lockhart, who, uh, who has been accused of having B cups as her character model in the Final Fantasy VII remake looks different from her extra busty appearance in PS1 era, as well as the entire female cast of Mortal Kombat 11, for that matter. Um, what about Laura Croft back in the early PC days where they were just triangles? Now, these are fictional women who have top of the line physical uh, physics engines supporting them. <laughs> so I really need the extra support. Uh, from an $80 uh, Lulum Lemon uh, sports bra. But if you're going to use sports bras as a shorthand to talk about fake uh, women's bodies, we're going to do it right. Okay, I'm not going to say that. Uh, lucky for you, I know a thing or two about, okay. Uh, it has two main components, the cup and the band. Yep. Size is denoted by letters. Okay, yep. And the band is the number, is basically the number of inches, the person's rib cage. Uh, right under the actual breast. And it's, secure, it's secretly the more important size. Uh, why? not sure i believe that while most people tend to focus on the cup letter uh it's a band size that determines cup size no it isn't it's the difference uh so if you have two people whose actual whose actual breasts are exactly the same size but whose band sizes are different they'll wear different bras uh 36 double d for instance is the same as 30 yep if you go down a cup size a brand size you go up a cup size um, same size, especially one has smaller rib cage. Uh, so the cup size scales up a bit. Well, I guess it depends on what you mean by same size. Cause there's a, this, uh, yeah. Cause basically on the 36, you're going to have a little bit more fat usually, or maybe they're a little bit bigger, you know, the, the rib cage is a little bit wider, maybe a little bit a wider person, uh, by, you know, two inches around is tough to know, but on a small rib cage. Okay. Uh, so, so why does big laundry do this? Because the cup size represents the difference between the band measurement and your breast measurement. So I told you that with one inch difference being an A and two on. So basically, uh, the bigger, the difference, the bigger the cup size. So then when you have this, there's a bigger difference, uh, to, with this person's band size to across the nipple line, essentially. Well, depending on the women, it might sag a little bit underneath, but, um, where there's 36, that's going to cut down. So, but that, what that means is, is that the band itself is, uh, the, their body, the more of the breast is below their skin, essentially. That's why the same size. Like, and I'm assuming what she means here is if you were to measure, if you could just measure the, the volume and weight of the breast tissue, they'd be the same. Uh, uh, anyway, back to Tifa. Tifa is a, is a woman of small rib cage. I guess that she's a 28 band size. If you look at her for, uh, for two seconds, you can see that chest is a lot bigger around uh, than her rib cage. Um, so that puts an F or G. Did you? Okay. Yep. I knew that. Uh, on top of that, we're also been some discussion around remake Tifa's bra, especially, um, specifically that she's wearing a sports bra. Sports bras are generally a bit more constricting in terms of fit. Yep. Uh, main, they're mainly trying to keep everything from bouncing so much. You also see sports bras sold in dress sizes or in the smaller. Okay. Because of the 
Design and further size restriction sports bras often make uh, cups look flatter. Sometimes, yes, they can also make them look bigger. They can also shove them up a little bit more and be more supportive. Uh, she's wearing a hundred. Okay, <laughs> uh, we needed to know it was hundred bucks. Um, intimidate. Okay, that in, imitates the look of a regular uh, bra. I'd argue the type of bra she's allegedly wearing has little to no effect on the perceived size of her chest or how hard she punches the hell out of things. That's true. And so while it may be true that Tifa's chest looks smaller than it used to, uh, the thing is, is I think it is probably drawn a little bit smaller, but when you scale everything around and you give a, a nicer contour to the face and the shoulders, uh, and then you have a concept of a sports bra on top of it. Uh, it can um, give some of those illusions. But again, I think this is a controversy. I don't know anybody who is is complaining, um, you know, but they did make um, uh, Laura Croft's boobs smaller. And then when they rebooted, she was young and, and almost flat. I and mean, then the movies, good grief, she's even flatter. Um, and a rib cage size instead. Uh, every female has a AB cup boobs. Uh, you're just wait a minute. If you video games and being censored because suddenly every yes, but this is what we're seeing. We're also seeing this in a lot of movies where the women in like Star Wars, with the exception of Jen Erso, are just I mean they're chosen because they look more uh, like boys. I think they look less. They've let they have few far fewer curves. And that's, I think, what a lot of people are. So I think this lady misses the point altogether. How, it's funny how quickly I've grown up in sort of drama. Um, I don't know. This is uh, both the writer and the article and the people who talk to the experts. Uh, has to be gay. Everyone has to <laughs> want to be men. Men want to be women. Okay, that's that's probably true. Uh, does a great video in this article on YouTube. It's hilarious. Uh, yep, that's how I found out about it. I see a clickbait worked. <laughs> anyway, I... Uh, I don't, I, do you think it's a controversy? I don't think it's a controversy. Um, but you know, unless you know the scale of previous ones and lots of times it's just the technology, you know, this was the technology of time. The early Laura Croft was this way. Cause that's, um, how things were, you know, were done and, uh, the, the polygon count and everything else. And I do a lot of three, I do 3d renders. I don't do 3d modeling, but I use Daz studio. And uh, this is actually one of the questions. How tall is Vicky? And you look at V3, V4, uh, V5, 6, 7, 8. I've got all these different versions of uh, Vicky. the most popular uh, model they have uh, based on various Genesis. And it's amazing that you put them together. You put them in a scene together, and they are different sizes. Um, that some are slightly taller. Um, some are a little bit more curvy. Uh, base models. Now, I'm not talking any, any additional morphs that people put on there and everything else. Uh, and sometimes it's just an illusion and it's the, because the, the amount of polygons and the smoothness of the curve, say of the shoulder and stuff, it is very difficult for, um, computers to calculate or to draw nice curves. And then when you make a three dimensional curve, such like say under her chin here, that, that takes a lot of computing power. And this is a modern, you know, we can finally do this in modern machines. So I think part of it's that. And I also don't think this is a controversy. Um, I'm sure someone made a comment somewhere and then it's being blown all out of proportion and uh, used to, to get idiots like me to do videos on it. So what do you think? Uh, you think this is nothing or you think this is, oh my God, it's the end of the world. Let me know in the comments below. Thank you very much. Goodbye. All right. <clears throat> Last one. Then we got other things to do. Um, hold on. Uh, okay, here we go. Three, two, one.